What's up everybody? It's your boy Duty back again with another video. Today I am strolling down memory lane because, well, we didn't have any DSP yesterday and he didn't make an ass of himself. So I figured, let me go down memory lane and make some videos uh, so that we can enjoy and laugh at Phil. So this is part one of four. I'm calling this crying emojis. So let's get into the videos. Peeps. Yeah. Like, it's been tough. You know, my life has been tough over the last decade. It has. And when I read a it's message like tough. that, I'm sorry that I'm tearing up like a baby. But when I read a message like that, it makes me feel like it was worth it. You know, like, all the shit that happened to me, and all the stress and the, the mental shit that I go through on a daily basis, sometimes. Sometimes. R.I.P.T. Wherever you at, pimps. You know what, man? You just just have them. He said, "Just have them. Just take them." And he gave him all. That was the kind of guy that he was, you know, like the nicest possible guy. Um, everyone who ever met him loved him. Crying emojis in the chats, pimp. Crying emojis. And that was disgusting. And, uh, Wiping your tears you know. in your shirt. That's disgusting, pimp. Get a napkin. I mean, it was the nicest thing. He definitely didn't have to do that. He basically just said, here, what ones don't you have? And he just, he gave me all, all the ones I didn't have. He gave me the whole set. If only he was there to give you that Wolverine figure you wanted that your parents didn't give you. Maybe you, you would have turned out Maybe you have no as idea. a better he person. He was murdered. And, uh, you know, everyone in Connecticut was never the same after that. We were all, you know, totally different people because we couldn't deal with it because it was so messed up. It was my first encounter with real death and loss. And, you know, lucky for me that I did keep them. Because, you know, as I got older, I didn't really care about those kind of collectibles or whatever anymore. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think they're totally maybe emotional. You cared for them so much that you had them thrown in a closet full of trash and mold. Okay, pimp. That was great, man. That was a really good game. Now other people are crying because it's contagious. Crying is contagious. Emotion is contagious, right? Also, so is uh, yawning for some odd reason. That was great, but now I gotta blow my nose. I can't even talk because my nose is completely congested because I started crying like a baby. So hold on a second. Then I'll give you my thoughts after I blow my nose. Oh. She did kill him. Propaganda people. Spread to quell fears after the war. Fabric of my being, I know he still lives. I bet you he cries bacon grease. Pretty heavy conversation, man. If you do not mind, Peter Quill. Oh yeah, that's when he was playing Galaxy of the Guardians and just whimpering like a baby. Thinking probably about how he mistreated his mother and father. Will. He was probably thinking about how he was a creeper with Panda Lee. Actually, it, it, that scene legitimately made me tear up. <laughs> I couldn't help it. The scene legitimately it was good writing and it made me tear up. Now I gotta go blow my nose. Because I'm just a big sissy. <laughs> I'm just a big sissy. You guys know that, right? I'm just a big, a big ball of emotion, tears, sadness.
He, this, this, he can't mute his damn mic. Nobody wants to hear that nasty snort of his. Emotions, so I don't cry for the rest of the stream. I'm just a bit, I'm such a big sissy. Oh, man. I still cry when I watch Bambi and his mom dies. <clears throat> I certainly wasn't expecting a, a story about a cat like this to make me tear up today. What the hell? <laughs> this is completely unexpected. Oh my god, I'm crying. He feels guilty <laughs> for mistreating wow. Jasper. Okay. All right, Man, that, that means the world to me when I get a message like that. Like, it's been tough. You know, my life has been tough over the last decade. It has. And when I read a message like that, I'm sorry that I'm tearing up like a baby. But when I read a message like that, it makes me feel like it was worth it. You know, like, all the shit that happened to me and all the stress and the, the mental shit that I go through on a daily basis, sometimes. On, on a daily basis. Sometimes, okay, then it's not a daily basis, pimp. It's occasional. Good lord, what's wrong with these locales? Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I enjoyed it. There were way more videos that, eh, you know, he, he, he was being a turd and they were too long to clip, but I thought this was a great representation of our boy Phil fake crying and trying to get some sympathy, which we don't give our boy Phil any sympathy whatsoever. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope it didn't make you tear up too much. And one more thing, pimps. Ryan emojis in the chat. Peace out.